as in its full time. France have advanced to the quarterfinals as expected. I told you guys, 1 0. Check the live stream. I said 1 0 and finished 1 0. France have advanced uh, to the next round. It's deserved. It's deserved. Vertonghen on goal, 86 minutes in. Kolomani shot. It deflected off of Vertonghen and it goes in. It go, it's, it's given as an own goal. It's given as an own goal. But look. Belgium fought, 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 defended, 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 and finally cracked. Finally cracked. And this is France's day. This is France's day. And tactically, you wonder if maybe Belgium wanted to attack, maybe wanted to be a little bit more offensive, maybe they could have gotten something today. But instead, they go out. And I think Lukaku, De Bruyne, Doku, all of them, for sure, they're going to be disappointed they will be disappointed the fact that they haven't really gone for this game they haven't really attacked france and i think they will be disappointed but as for france massive win and now this is what it looks like this is what it looks like now uh the quarterfinals the quarterfinals are here so we've seen spain and germany are and the um and the quarterfinals Spain and Germany are in the quarterfinals and the other half, the other half you're looking at is France now and France. And they're going to be playing the winner of Portugal or Slovenia, which is coming up next. We will see what's going to happen in that match. But France have put themselves in the quarterfinals. Look, England, Switzerland is in the quarterfinals. Spain, Germany in the quarterfinals. And France now have put themselves into the quarterfinals. Look, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I think you have to be, you have to be disappointed uh, uh, if you are a, a Belgium fan. Really, really disappointing. Really, really disappointing. Just half-hearted stuff. Just push and go all out. At least the last 15, 20 minutes. But they just defended the whole game and they paid for it in the end. I mean, they played Kevin De Bruyne as a quarterback, like uh, way in midfield, way deep in the midfield. And that's not the position that KDB want to be in. But tactically, that's what they wanted to do in this game. And ultimately, it's about winning. This game is about winning. And again, France doesn't really score themselves. They get an own goal, but this is what they do. They only have a penalty goal and one own goal. And now there's going to be two goals uh, from an own goal position. So crazy, crazy. France just, France feels like the Real Madrid of international football. They just know how to grind out games they know how to win matches they can win games in different kind of ways so that's the reason why france is the favorite for this tournament it's because of that it's because of that but that is it people thank you all for watching uh john says is this the coach the players in general i have to say it's the coach i think i don't i don't i'm not gonna pl blame the, pl the, the players for belgium today because they were told to sit back what can they do kdb is playing a CDM position and that is not an accident that is by design that is by design and that is coming from up top it's coming from the manager he decided to play that way and he paid for it he paid for it I think France was there for the taking they didn't really impress me that much they didn't really create a whole lot of chances in this game they could have went after France on the counter they didn't and now they are out simple as this simple as this but yeah guys that is it thank you all for watching us make sure to join us for the portugal game i'm going to be live after this so be be sure to tune in and that's it people thank you for joining us make sure you smash a like subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel but i'm out of here peace